And hello to you from Hertfordshire. The venue for this game is Vicarage Road. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we're on the cusp of bringing you live action from one of the most exciting leagues in Europe, the Championship. It's Watford, and they face Luton Town. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, putting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And so the initial 11 for Watford. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, in this shape, unless their wing backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. And this confrontation is underway. Johnson. Well, he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw in. Carlton Morris it's looking promising and it crossed the touchline so a throw in here element of risk there but he's won the ball Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. And there's the delivery. Oh, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Well, they're playing well now, and these fans can sense a goal coming. Over it comes. That's a routine take. Failed to keep hold of it. Campbell.
In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. This to make it 1-0. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it. Now sending it in. Fine teamwork to win it back. It did look on for them, but not to be. This is looking threatening, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And attempting the through ball. Well, not to be. He had moved into an illegal position. Well, it's great that he wants to run in behind, but he has to get the timing right. Brennan Johnson. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Played in there, well cleared away. Running with the ball confidently. How about the cross? Preferring to go infield, no way through. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Johnson. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Straight offside, but only just. Morris. Well, the pass not finding its target. Trying to really get up the opposition here. Johnson. And space to cross it. Giving it a try. The save was a good one. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Corner kick played in. Not the best clearance. And he clears the danger. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Flirting with more than a bit of danger following that challenge. He's already been booked. And he is going to pay the ultimate price. Well, when you're on a yellow card, it was a silly challenge. He just lost his discipline there. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. In 
Into the box it goes. Ramsey. Going well. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. I believe changing circumstances in the Burnley game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal for Burnley. They're back level. It's one all with 41 minutes on the clock. Thank you, Alex. Ramsey. Emile Smith Rowe. Powell has it. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Oh, great attacking play. Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. Berry. A running room in the wide position. And a goal! The equaliser! They simply refuse to be beaten. Down to ten men, but right back in this game. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in Hertfordshire. Certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, that's exactly what his team needed because they weren't at their best in the first half. And once again, it shows what a key player he is. Can they build on that in the second 45? And so... Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Collins. Curtis Jones. And he takes it on! Just made sure nothing came of that. Well, covering up defensively. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Clark. Elijah Adebayo. Could be a chance to break here. Can they nudge in front? And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Brennan Johnson. Well, there's been a lot of speculation as regards this transfer and whether it would go ahead. It's finally been confirmed, Stuart. Well, that's about £55 million. I would say it's a good deal for everyone, particularly the player who can now show what a great talent he really is. Tremendous block. 
After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Substitution time it is here. Skimming the crossbar, so unfortunate, Stuart. Well, it just doesn't come down in time, does it? But it's a wonderful effort, you have to say. Well, more championship action for you to look forward to on EA TV. It's Watford versus Sunderland. This is looking threatening. Crossing into the middle, read it well. Campbell. Nakamba, using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. So a half an hour remaining. Well, as you can see, it's been all Watford in the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. It's a perfect challenge. Oh, he's gone for goal. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Now they've decided to make a change. Over it comes. Free kick awarded then by the referee. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Campbell. Burke. The thrills and spills of championship action. Join us for this one, live on EA TV. It's Luton Town facing Reading. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Now can they counter clinically? No foul play, says the referee. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Marvellous Nakamba. And he read it well defensively. Well, not long left now, but this crowd have been brilliant. Can the players get a winner here? And the pass could do damage. He might be able to make it through. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Campbell. On Yedinma. And Watford with the ball again.
Can't miss, surely. Excellent block. And there to intervene. Saar. Takes it on. Well, goodness me. Into the goalkeeper's grateful grasp. And a change to the scoreline in the Preston game. Details from Alex Scott. It's a second goal for Sheffield United. They're ahead by two now with just under 10 minutes left to play. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Oh, what a fine save, and a timely one, Stuart. Well, that does give them some hope, because that would have been the end. So, a personnel change then. Corner kick played in. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. So almost at full time, and the home side on course to eke out a narrow win. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it's been a decent performance from them. They've certainly played the more expansive football and had the better individuals. Can they now just see this through? Not long left. Running with the ball confidently. Saar. Still trying to make something happen. Jones. And options in the centre. And that's a high quality stop. Well, it may not count for anything, but that was a great save, wasn't it? Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. Delivering it. Not away completely. And a time for calm on the ball. And there it is, the final whistle. The story here, a victory for Watford. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 